my name is Roger Palomino. I'm going to help you guys out today doing partial fractions in Cal 2. Okay, this is the integral we're going to be solving today. It's going to be the integral x minus 9 over x plus 5 times x minus 2 dx is going to... Okay, we're going to write this integral here as an equation here. x minus 9 over x plus 5 times x minus 2 is going to be equal to ax plus 5 plus b over x minus 2. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to we're going to multiply the quantity x minus x plus 5 x minus 2 by on both sides so we can take out the fractions on both sides of the equation. Now let's, con now, let's continue from here. We're going to have after you did the multiplication on both sides, you should have x minus 9 a times x minus 2 plus b times x plus 5. From here, we're going to make we're going to make x equal a value. So this way, we can take out a variable, either a or b, whichever your choice. We, we'll say that x equal two, so the a will fall out, and then we just substitute two where we say x. Okay, from here, we're going to substitute two on both sides. So after you substitute two, you're supposed to get minus seven equals b of seven, because you after computation, you'll have b will equal 1, minus 1. Okay, now, we want to get rid of the a, I mean, get rid of the b. So, we'll solve for a. So, we're going to say that x equal minus 5, so the b will fall out on both sides. So, now, we'll have minus 5 minus 9, a minus 5 minus 2, which we have minus 14 equal minus 7a. So, our a is going to be a plus 2. Okay. Now we're going to rewrite the problem we start out with it's to become what we solve for a and b. We're going to have our new integral, whatever our a was, 2x plus 5dx plus our integral minus 1 over x minus 2dx. Okay, from here, we're going to factor out our constants, 2 1 over x plus 5 dx minus the integral 1 over x minus 2 dx. And here you can see that there's a relationship between the equation of the x and the 1, so we can make a u substitution or just go directly for an ln substitution. Okay, from here, so now our, our solution is going to be 2 times ln absolute value x plus 5 minus ln absolute value x minus 2 plus some arbitrary constant c. And we're done. So this is how we do partial fractions. And I hope, uh, thank you for watching this video and I hope you enjoyed it and send us any comments, comments or emails. We'd really appreciate it to know how, how we're doing. Thank you.